Gossip Girl, and I'm Katie from 93.3 FLZ, and this is the Caddy Corner. Uh, just a place for you to get your fix. Top of the list this week are the hottest, strangest music videos. I love it. They're crazy now. Number one, Katy Perry's California Girls. What do you think? Well, this is awesome. Like, this is funny. Did you hear that uh, when she did the video, she banned men from the set because she's naked, and then it's just like um. It's like a Candyland theme, but it's very, like, sexual. Yeah. <laughs> like, the costumes, I can see this October on a lot of the girls that are downtown wearing their little shimmies yeah. for Halloween. They're actually kind of cute. Little peppermint cute. over the boobies and mm -hmm. the um, cupcakes. And she's cotton candy and the different color wigs. And Snoop. And I like the part when the gummy bear flips her off. <laughs> it's good, creative. That made me laugh. <laughs> Pretty crazy. Number two, um, Kesha's Your Love Is My Drug. It's cool. So, you know, it starts in a desert. There's, she's wearing, like, dead animals on her head, and then it goes into that weird trippy Daigle thing that she did on SNL. It was crazy. Um, you interviewed her the other day, right? I did. She's very nice. She's. A <laughs> I asked her about the rumor where uh, she said that she had been known to give dog poop as Christmas presents to people. I called her out and I was like, what's up with that? I'm like, I would punch you if you did that to me. And she said, well, I'm crazy, don't mess with me, so. Oh, all right. Uh, number three, Lady Gaga, Alejandro. Yeah. This one's interesting because a lot of people were giving her flack for like, there's a lot of like religious imagery. It's a lot of like, you know, fabulous gay men in heels and fishnets. Kind of Madonna-esque, <laughs> Madonna yeah. but it's Lady Gaga. Would you expect anything else? <laughs> um, Bulletproof. La Rue, this is like um, a duo from Europe. They're huge. I love that song. I love this song. I think the video is actually really cool. Everyone thinks she's so hideous, but actually I think it's just the hair that's messing it up. The eye makeup in the video I thought was really, really yeah, cool. Yeah, it's also freaky because it doesn't look like she has like, eyelashes. Yeah. But, um, but it's good, and the clothing is just crazy, but good. Um, number five, our last one, Miley Cyrus Can't Be Tamed. This song is hot, and I don't even like Miley Cyrus, and I no. love this song in the video. It's, like, ridiculous. The video is pretty cool, very weird. She starts off, like, in a nest, and she comes up, she has these, like, wings, and yeah. it's crazy, but it's good. But you have to think of, like, the imagery, like, you know, she's, like, like coming out of the nest, she's growing up. She can't be tamed, people. Don't hold her down. Yep, but she is not a hussy. She's not a slut. That's what she said. All right, so entertainment news for this week. Um, Amanda Bynes, you'll know her from All That and... Bring It On. Uh, was she in Bring It On? Yeah, I think she was in one of the cheerleading or Step It Up or one of those... Oh, uh, what, a, what a Man Wants or I'm a Man. Hairspray, yep. She played uh, the girl with the pee on her. And um, she... <laughs> She decided to, decided to uh, retire from acting at the age of 24 because she no longer enjoys it. Also, I think not having any roles might have a part in it. Do, do people retire or do they just stop? Like, is that weird, right? It Celine is. Celine Dion retires and then Girlfriend comes back like 10 times, so. Yeah. I'm pretty sure she'll be coming back. She wants to make a big scene. Yes. Uh, people have already began camping out in order to get a look at the stars of Eclipse who will be walking the red carpet on Thursdays, 8 p.m. E. Uh, they're broadcasting live for the event, the big premiere. Um, are you Team Edward or Team Jacob? Oh man, I don't know. I Do you like vampires or werewolves? I think I'd go with the werewolf. Even yeah, I'd go werewolf. So I'd go Jacob. I heard that um, I don't know their names that are dating, but they broke up. The girl, oh, Robert Pattinson and Chris yes. Stewart. Uh, she's foul. Who would date her? Yeah, I heard he got sick of her unruly, like, miserableness and is yeah. done. You just see pictures of her. Her face always looks like she's, like, smelling a fart. <laughs> it's like, smile. Try to enjoy life. You're making a lot of money right now. Um, and uh, finally, we're talking about hot or not. Rihanna has a new haircut that is ketchup red and shaved on the side. Um, it's crazy <laughs> and not so hot in my opinion. Yeah, I mean, she's, she's got a pretty face. I had a girlfriend in college who shaved her head, and just because she had a pretty face, she was able to pull it off. But still, I don't really encourage anybody to just, like, you know. But she is on our list, so obviously she has drawn some attention. That's true. Yeah. All right, she so what's shy. hot this week, this weekend? Um, on Thursday, Hush, huge birthday.
USA Bash, first day pup, 93.3. Are you going to be there? I am going to be there. I'm going to be there. So you guys come out. It's going to be a good time. And we haven't talked about Soho, South Tampa, South Howard, McDenton's, always a place to go. I know they have a killer happy hour, and it's always packed. The Dubliner, it's such a cool little Irish like bar. That. Wine, all different imports, cool bar. Um, and next door, right down the way from them, is Cheap. You said you Cheap love is it. Cheap dope. They have this really good uh, strawberry champagne sangria with yes. tons of brandy in it. And it's sneaky. You gotta be careful because you'll have a couple drinks. Oh, no, 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 I'm fine. And then. Yep, it's champagne. Um, and then Cork. <laughs> Cork's a cool little wine bar down there, so if you uh, enjoy wine. Or a good night out, South Howard is a good time. Until next week, TTYL. Bye!